Now to the foreign scene. The Speaker of the ECOWAS Parliament, Mustafa Sisselo, has expressed his unhappiness at the low number of women in the ECOWAS Parliament. He bared his mind on this subject when he held talks with the President of Burkina Faso, Roj Kabore, and the first Deputy Speaker of Burkina Faso Parliament in the capital of Burkina Faso. Our diplomatic affairs correspondent, Shegun Wojimu, reports. It is the second day of this delocalized meeting of the Joint Committee on Political Affairs, Peace, Security, Gender and Women Empowerment in Ouagadougou. Some members of this committee are accompanying the Speaker to the National Parliament, where he meets the first Deputy Speaker. Here, he tells his host he is unhappy with the few women the Equals Parliament currently has. Mr. Cicero's displeasure is justified. Senegal, his own country, is doing great on this front. In 2018, women made up over 41% of Senegal's parliament. Niger, Burkina Faso and Gabon were all doing better than Nigeria, all in double digits. Women representation in Niger's parliament is up to 13.3 percent. A 2019 report by the International Republican Institute and the National Democratic Institute shows that the Nigerian Senate has the lowest rate of women's legislative participation in sub-Saharan Africa. During the 8th Senate, only 7 out of 109 senators were women. We also managed to ask the Burkina Faso head of state to be our voice in forum of the ECOWAS heads of state and government to handle with the future of our organization. We also talked about the fourth legislature and the coming fifth legislature and then and that we expect the incoming members of parliament to continue our work and maybe do better than us. Therefore, there are some major points like the gender issue. We must achieve uh, having about 30% of women per country inside ECOWAS Parliament. Ghana, Togo, Ivory Coast, Guinea and Burkina Faso all hold one form of election or the other in 2020. The speaker is hoping that the region's leaders will see that it makes common sense to have more women in their respective parliaments. Shagwa Jumu, STV News.